One thing I'm sure about is that left alone, we can't do it. We have failed. Left alone, Iraqis failed to sort Iraq out. Left alone, Kurds may well fail to sort it out because it's complex. Left alone, Syria will not sort itself out. Turkey will not sort it out. So a superpower that is seriously interested in peace, I'm not saying democracy though, but seriously interested in peace in the region, should be more closely engaged rather than leave it all to its own accord or to other superpowers to say, okay, we are not the only superpower in the world. Well, that approach has been detrimental. Um, accepting that left alone we may not find our way easily, uh, given the complexity of region, we are in a very, very tough, tough neighborhood. No other neighborhood is as tough as that. Over the, over the last, what, centuries has been like that. Now, the United States approach uh, as, as a superpower has been really, um, in, in many ways, dealing with real politics of the day uh, in, in over the century, over the decades but now um, uh, the way that the the current administration handled Iraq's complexity uh, has been really um, the consequences of that have been very dire, very um, expensive on us too uh, in Baghdad in 2011 the decisions that were made the uh, renewal of, of Maliki's second term. All of these were, uh, they, they happened after a judgment made here that this is the best thing for US and Iran. So a lot of these things happened and, and in Kurdistan again the engagement of arriving at the last minute do a little bit with minimalistic approach is not going to help, it has to be sustained. Now everybody in Kurdistan is grateful for United States uh, sacrifices, contribution, uh, engagement, and they have been really uh, vital for, for survival of this uh, nation. I mean, last year, Daesh could have occupied Erbil had it not been for the American intervention and the Allies. But saving them from that danger and, 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 and uh, uh, establishing some partnership, a limited partnership, is one thing. But actually making this partner better democratic, better institutionalized, better established, and uh, have better future is another. At the moment, the United States' approach is too distant, too minimalistic, and too remote. We, we need, for the sake of both the United States and Kurdistan, we need greater, closer engagement, because we think that whatever happens in Kurdistan and Iraq is directly linked to the national security interest of the United States of America.